Hello, Frederick here, FNI. Today I would like to tell you about progressive web applications. Now, progressive web applications are applications that are based on the cloud with the same behavior and UI as the normal mobile application. It is not all the applications that has the PWA versions. The beauty of PWA and your normal mobile application is that PWA conserves space, right? So for instance, I have the PWA version of Telegram and the normal mobile application of Telegram. Now let's see the storage space. So going down to Telegram, you will see two applications. Now you see the first Telegram with 75.36 MB and the second Telegram with 264 KB. Now by using PWA, with if you're having storage issue, this is also a way of conserving more space on your phone. So how do you get these PWA applications? Just like Google Play Store and every other um, app store, there are app stores that actually houses only a directory of progressive web applications and one of such which is considered the best is AppScope. Now to get AppScope on your phone, you need to go to your browser and search up AppScope, alright? So you will see appsco.pe, that is A-P-P-S-C-O dot P-E, alright? So that is the application. Once you open it, you will be asked to add the application as your home screen. And that is actually how you install the application. It's just a home screen. So if we go back to my storage space, alright, so this is AppScope only has 239 kilobytes all right so once you add the app scope as your home screen that actually means you have installed it all right so to get any of your applications or to search the applications that are available on pwa you just tap search then you see browse progressive web applications all right so let's go to social now on the social we only have twitter we have tinder we have telegram we have pinterest we have google plus we have um instagram tumble for the most popular applications okay so i've already shown you a comparison of the normal telegram application and the pwa version and it still gives you the look and feel or the look and behavior of your normal application okay to save any of the application tap on the application for instance alibaba so tap on launch tap on launch app so once the application is open just tap on the menu bar at the top right then you see add to home screen so it's going to add the application to home screen then it installs okay now to open the application so you see it still has just the same look like your normal alibaba application all right just the same everything let's go and compare the two alibaba application okay so this is the alibaba.com or aliexpress 436 and this is the one that the normal mobile application that i already had 275 all right so this is actually how you can also save space on your smartphone by switching from your normal mobile application to progressive web applications. I hope you got value. Comment down below.